Hey y'all, so jumping right into it, I'm going to be using my P. Louise base in 0.5. I'm using a flat brush to just spread it all out. I'm not using a whole, whole lot because the top part of my eye, I'm not really focusing on color. We're going to keep it real neutral and actually very, very simple. Um, as you've seen the picture, the bottom lash line is where we do the rainbow look. But I still like to prime my eyes with a nice base, so whatever shadows I use, and they give off the same color that I intend for them to be. Okay, so next we're going to be using the Juvia's Place Gulu Palette. I love this palette in case y'all can't tell. I've used it in the past two little videos. But anyways, I'm just going to be using a little pencil brush and the brown out of that palette and I'm just going to make a line along my crease and all I'm doing right now I'm, it looks like I'm blending but really all I'm doing is just adding product so I can later buff it out because you don't want that line if you don't want that line you want to make sure it's blended and put well together because it's going to be real neutral so nothing crazy Alright, next I'm taking another pencil brush. It's just a little bit more fluffy and I'm just going to blend out that line and add a little bit of the orange that's in that Zulu palette. Alright, so next all I'm using is that same brush, and I'm just going back in with that same first brown that we kind of lost when I got to blending the other color. And yeah, so I'm just adding that just to add a little bit more depth into the look. Alright, so next I'm getting my MAC Semi Sweet palette. I'm just getting that black is um, carbon by MAC. Um, I believe that's the exact same one that's in that palette. You can use any black. I'm not using a lot. I'm really, really not. I'm just using a little bit just to add even more depth because I just felt like, I don't know, I just like it. <laughs> Alright, so next all I'm getting is that same flat brush and that same exact base. And I'm just going to put that on my eyelid to kind of erase where I was messy with the other eyeshadow along my crease. Um, I'm not doing a, a cut crease or anything like that. I just really want to make it a clean space so that this eyeshadow that I'm going to use on my lid shows up a lot better. Alright, so next, all I'm taking is my NYX Avant Pop palette and y'all I've had this for a minute but I love that eyeshadow in the palette so that's the only one I really want to use but it's like a white champagne color it's got a little bit of sparkle not a whole lot but um yeah it just adds a little bit of shine to my lid and I'm gonna put that exactly where I put that base Alright, next all I'm going to do is my liquid liner. Um, I always say this, if y'all want to know how I do my eyeliner, because it hasn't changed at all. I use the same product and I do it the same way. Sometimes I just do it more dramatic than others. Um, go watch my eyeliner tutorial, okay? Because y'all always ask me how I learn how to do my eyeliner so fast and so good. And that's all I do, okay? That's all I do, my video. I'm going to link it below. Y'all better go watch it. Alright, so boom. Next, we get in that same base. That base is our bestie, okay? The base is just going to make these colors pop and make it look like these are more expensive eyeshadows than what they really are. But little do they know, these are like drugstore brands. Like, this stuff is so cheap. So, I'm actually using a paintbrush to just get this where I want it to because paintbrushes are a little bit easier to work with. I'm using liquids like this. I can get it exactly where I want it. Why was I bucking my eyes like that? Um, yeah, so I'm just putting that along my entire lash line on the bottom. 
And then I'm going to go in with my eyeshadows here in a sec. Alright, so next, we're just getting the yellow at the Zulu palette, okay? This is so simple, y'all. I promise. I promise. I'm just getting a little pencil brush, and I'm going on the top part of my, what is this, my inner corner? I'm just only going to go on the top, and then next, we're going to get the orange out that same palette. Then we're going to get the pink out of my BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette, and all the colors that I'm using are in that, that palette. The only color from my Zulu palette that I'm using is from... Um, is the yellow. I'm sorry. The only color from my Zulu palette is the yellow. Pinged up cooking. Here, I'm just going in with the purple next, y'all. So, one thing that I did make sure I did, because I y'all know I don't bake. I, I don't bake under my eyes because I'm dry as hell. I'm, I'm dry like a damn dancer. But I made sure I baked with doing this because I didn't want any of these eyeshadows to leave too much fallout under my eyes with my concealer. Um, so, I made sure I kept my, my setting powder under there. Oh, right here, all I'm doing is putting a little bit more of that base so that pink can pop a little bit more. It wasn't doing enough for me. So, you can layer that base and it will make things seem a little bit more intense. You see that pink popped a little bit more? That's the only thing I did. And I did that with just the pink. So, yeah, I didn't do that with any of the other colors. And it made it look a lot more intense. And it popped. And, yeah. Yeah. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, please make sure you do and hit that notification bell and give this video a thumbs up. Thanks. Bye.